Hi, I want to give you a little bit of background as to a topic that I think is really quite important. The first idea here is to consider a mineral that you maybe not, haven't heard of called cassiterite. What cassiterite is, is tin oxide, a really quite simple substance. And why is that important? That's important due to this particular chemical reaction when you take charcoal, heat it up with tin oxide, the carbon grabs onto the oxygen, makes CO2, and you make elemental tin. And why is that important? That's important because all of the kind of devices that we use from day to day, television, uh, all manner of video materials are brought together by this tin that's needed in every single one of these appliances. Where is it found? Well, you find it in Africa amongst a few other places in the world and the circle indicates that it's right at the border of the Congo and Rwanda. And the problem with that is that this is disputed area and the way that this is gathered is by individuals who live in a what's called a village. It's really a small city of 10,000 people who the people unfortunately live in this rather difficult set of conditions and this is where the cassiterite is found in order to make the tin to make the products that we are all familiar with. It's generated by going out inside caves, inside earth devices, earth materials like you see here brought together. It's brought on by washing the earth over the minerals, picked up, and that's the mineral that you see right there. Uh, the difficulty is that people have to do this and bag it, and there's no roads that lead out. The, the individuals who carry this out do so on their backs with very heavy packs over about a 30 kilometer or 50 kilometer 30 mile distance and it goes through the jungle as you see in these photographs and brought out to the final resting place where shortly after they're going to be taken away this is a hundred million dollar plus involvement with the exportation of this Airplanes don't even have a proper runway to, to land on, and I think the best quote associated with this wake-up call is what I think it is when I read about it, because I was not really even aware how this was carried out, is from uh, this woman who is the New York Times uh, West Africa bureau chief, uh, unearthed by the poor, controlled by the strong, and consumed by a world oblivious of their origins. And I offer this as a perspective on all of what we do day to day with our electronics. So if you are going to be involved with these, at least dispose of them in a proper and appropriate kind of fashion. Thanks very much.